All right, so we got Starfield 16 minutes of gameplay demos right to the video. Now listen, we're not about to sit here and react to the whole six. We got more videos to do, okay? But we will dabble onto the gameplay. We'll see. We'll see what this is about, man. This video game is long awaited, right? Everybody's waiting for this, including me, but you know. Oh, see, so you know what? This could be scary, though. Especially to, like, somebody that, like, Bro, like, this would give me, like, uh, y'all ever, like, be playing a game? You ever, like, drive really fast on GTA? And, like, you get, like, you get, like, a little anxiety? Like, like, oh, and then, like, you look away? Bro, imagine, like, space. Oh, my God. Imagine, like, people that, like, don't like space or whatever, and they play this game. Bro, they're gonna freak out, bro. That's, like, crashing into Saturn. Oh, 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 oh. That's like crash into like a planet on here, bro. That would be scary because this is in first person. This is kind of like Star Fox in first person. Oh, so when that, oh, you can actually go third person too whenever like you're uh, boosting, I guess. Unlocking oh, okay, the I like that. Control system skill will allow you to zero in on specific subsystems of the ship you target. Okay. Oh, so you can shoot at specific things. Ooh, that's kind of cheese. I like it though. Oh, um, okay. After destroying an enemy ship, you can loot the remains from your cockpit. Oh, you can loot the remains that are flying to you. Okay, in-game footage. Starfield is our first new universe in over 25 years. That's in-game. Still a Bethesda RPG through and through. Where but that's the other thing. Oh, good job. And you get that feeling of unlimited possibilities. But this time, it's not just one world. Crafting systems, from running research projects with the resources you find to crafting weapon mods needed to survive. Okay, wait. So you're not only in space. You're on. You're on. A, you're on the ground too. You build your own outposts. These act as a home away from home for survival and resource generation. You can choose where and how to build each one, and you can hire characters you meet to keep it up and running. But that's not all. You can even build your own spaceships. Really? I'm about to make mines like, like 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 one of those things off of uh, Star Wars, bro. You can choose crew members, and yes, you can completely customize the look and layout. Wait a minute. Okay, hold up. Hold up. There's loads of different modules, ship manufacturers, and more. Okay, I hold up. It's so cool. We just absolutely love this. This is actually pretty nice. I like this. That's actually pretty Humanity you can your... has always wow. hunted for knowledge in the unknown. Wow. The wonder is not that the field of stars is so vast. Whoa, bro. Oh my god, that shot's so amazing. Bethesda! You know what? We're going to watch this trailer and then, and then I'm going to talk about it. We're going to talk about it. Wow. It's over a thousand worlds. Because the choice of where to go, it's not ours. It's yours. And it wasn't until now that we had the technology to create it. From the rocks at your feet to the mountains in the distance to the people and creatures that live in these worlds. That isn't just a backdrop. That moon is actually there orbiting the planet. Yes, you can visit it too. We realistically simulate the galaxy around you. Our next generation lighting model uses this is amazing, real time bro. global illumination to light the world based on the type of star and the makeup we also have an all new animation system. Listen. Okay, I'm going to stop course, it. You can play it in third person. 
and you can play it in first person. That's it. That's it. All right, listen, hold up. Whoa, okay, wait, they got everything in this game then. They have everything. Okay, but that's okay. Well done, bro. I can see why this game is very anticipated because number one, I thought that this was just a game to where, you know, you go out in space and you're, and you're like, you know, fighting, you know, people in space. Bro, you can go out, fight people in space with your own spaceship. You can create your own spaceship. You can land on different moons and planets. And then you can go build bases and outposts and stuff like that. And it's in first person and third person. I also wonder if they're going to have like actual, because obviously I've seen Saturn. I've, I've, I've seen Saturn like seven different times already. So obviously Saturn's in here, right? But I wonder if they're going to have like, you know, the like the official like planets names in here. Well, I don't, well, I don't think Saturn, <laughs> I don't think Pluto or Mars is going to come down to earth and like copyright these names. But, um, but at the end of the day, bro, this is absolutely sick, bro. This is amazing. Imagine like I land on, well, I can't really land on, I can't land on Jupiter. Jupiter's like all gas, right? I can't land on Jupiter, right? It's all gas. I mean, but like, imagine like you land on like Mars, right? Bro, and obviously, I mean, I think we've been on Mars before. So uh, I guess they can try to like, you know, they can try to like put some things that they, they, they uh, found out from Mars and like in, into the game, I guess. I don't know how they're gonna do it, but brother, this is absolutely crazy. This is like one big open universe game. Um, but yeah, it's just shots like this, bro. Hold on. I got to show y'all. First of all, shots like this, like, bro, like you're literally, you're literally in space, bro. It's ridiculous. Especially this is going to come out on the PS5 and the Xbox, the new Xbox uh, Series X, bro. This is amazing. Look at the sun right here. And then you have other, oh my. God, guys, I don't know what to say. I don't know. <laughs> listen, listen. Again, when I drive really fast on GTA 5, right? When I'm just zooming, right? I get so overwhelmed by like how fast I'm going that like, that like, I, like I get like too excited and I like look away because like I don't know, I don't, I don't know how to like describe that feeling, but like, bro, I'm gonna do the same thing here. I feel like whenever I, I'm like I'm playing this game and like I'm just going around whatever and I'm shooting people blah, 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 and then like I see a planet and I'm gonna get too overwhelmed to the point to where like I'm gonna like crash into this <laughs> I'm gonna crash into this planet. That is ridiculous, bro. This bro, oh my goodness. And then I can't lie, the part that got me really excited was creating your own spaceship. Now creating your own spaceship, that sounds like absolutely fuego bro fuego do you understand me bro i can make one of those spaceships from like star trek and star wars bro i can make like a little uh the, like a mandalorian i can make anything bro a spaceship bro i'm about to make my spaceship bro fast as life bro oh man i, I feel like this game can really like um challenge your like imagination and stuff like that when it when it comes down to especially like if you're really like interested in like space and stuff like that brother this game is for you I don't understand why you're just sitting there looking all looking all goofy goober. This game is for you. Do you understand that? If you're if you're really into space and stuff like that, then yeah, this is the this is the perfect game for you. I don't think I've ever played a space game like this before. I, obviously, I played like games that was like the background was space, but like I never played a, a game that was just about space and about planets and about you know the spaceships and stuff like that. I never played a game about that um, before. So this definitely will be the first. But yeah, I'm getting this. I cannot. I listen. I'm getting this. I am getting this, bro. Look at this. And then it, another thing is, this is in-game footage, by the way. In-game. This isn't like trailer thing. No, no. This is in-game footage. And it's in first and third person. I feel like third person would be a little too easy. So I'm going to go first person, especially whenever, whenever I'm flying. No, I feel like you... Mm, no. No, 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 no. I was going to say, whenever I'm in space and like I'm in my, like my space or whatever, I'm not going first person. No. No, 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 no. I'm going to crash into a planet and <laughs> I'm going to crash into like a little, a little uh, boulder, a little asteroid, bro. It's going to be over for me. I'm definitely going third person whenever I, I'm in space, though. That, that's definitely that's definitely uh, true for me. But other than that, comment down below. What do you guys think of Starfield? I think it's coming out this month or next month. 
um and, and yeah I, I just can't wait to the game uh i can't wait to the game come out so we can like you know do do a couple reactions no not couple until we do a couple no not couple until we do a few no not a few until we do a lot of videos on starfield and um i'll see you guys later for the next one i'm out and